Welcome to this video. This video is going to be really interesting because here we are going to generate some PDF reports. So we have seen in the last video how we can generate information and store in the MySQL database. Now what if, if you want to have a report like a daily report in PDF format which you can generate automatically from the data coming from MySQL or the data which you have in your PLC. So this is possible in Node-RED as well. So you don't have to have buy any extra plugin. There is a free open source plugin called PDF Maker. Using that, you can generate some reports. So I'm going to show you one example. Look at this scenario. We have this tank and these levels. I can turn it on. This is going to fill the tank and a little bit of draining. So let's say this is our real time environment. We want to notice a tank level and store that in the report. Okay. So not just the present level, I want to store what was the minimum, what was the maximum kind of analytics, which I told you in the beginning of this course. So I have three main levels. I can say average, minimum, and maximum. Okay, so let's check it out our database for us. So that's my database. And you can see here I have value coming in. And this is basically coming based on time. So if I show you my node red dashboard, so I have, you can see these values right now, my logging is stopped. So I start logging and now every five seconds, my values will be updated. So I use time based value. So you can see that average value is changing every five seconds and based on the levels, what was the minimum and maximum recorded already, this is updated. Okay. So we have some real time values and these values are actually coming from my database. We will discuss about how these tables are generated in the next videos, but here is just the overview of the project. So I started the logging and I see, okay, now my shift is over, whatever. I want to stop logging and I want to generate a report. So I go down, I type my name. So if I remove saying I type my name, Rajveer, here is my name and that's the current time and I click generate report in PDF. When I do that, now my PDF has been generated. I didn't took the feedback, but the values which are here will be printed in the PDF form, which I can show you here. So that's my report. And if I open it, you can see that I have a little bit customized the report. So let me just bring it like this. And that's my report. And if you notice the variables, so it says course interface MySQL with PLC by Node-RED topic report generation in PDF. It generated on this time and date, which I took from here. Now you can generate customized report of your data in Node-RED. This is just a sample report generated to explain the PDF function in Node-RED. Use again customized report based on the preference. Real world values from MySQL database called training.plc data. This is the database which was here. Sorry. Oh, this is tank level. I have to change the text. Okay. And I can also show you how to change the text. I forgot to change the table name because before I was using this table. Now I'm using another table. So the table name should be here tank level. Anyways, I can change that. The following table shows the value from tank one, tank two, or factory environment. You can see this value is coming from here. Tank one percentage from here, tank two centimeter. So you can actually see it's the current values. And on the bottom, I took some information. Hardware use, I'm using S7-1200 with OPC UA because I'm reading the values from Factor.io into my PLC and from PLC to my Node-RED. So I'm using some Ethernet cables, 24 volt power supply, software use. This is just uh, random information. You can also use the data of your machine here from where this data has been extracted. So just showing you the format. Software use, TIA portal v16, Factory.io if you want, you can click here and get to the Factory.io. Uh, you can download the software. This factory are node red and some hyperlink for the websites which I have. So some disclaimer. So you can also generate these PDF files from your real world data. This is what I want to show you. This is such an amazing thing. So let's try and change some values. So at the moment it's maximum full. I will do start logging. In this case, maybe the maximum level will change. You can see that it's changed here. So maybe I make some discharge. And let's notice values being changed now. And at some moment, I will stop. This is just to show you that real world values are coming. So I start stop logging and I click generate report. Now in this case, it will actually rewrite the, uh, rewrite the report 
the PDF file will be rewritten. Okay, so if I open it now, you can see these values are the current values. Looks really nice, right? So we are going to learn in the few in the next videos how to generate this report. Okay, and you can also generate multiple reports like every one hour or every one day or each day or each month, each weekend. You can generate some report of your data which is in your SQL or the data currently from your PLC. So if you find it interesting, I hope you will like this section. So in the next video, we'll start with the basic of reports. Okay, we will start with really basic how the reports can be generated with just simple information, a text file. And then we'll see how to customize your report based on what you want to see. It's very easy, just a little bit of HTML knowledge. So see you in the next video. Bye.